Amanda. Oh, you're joking. <laughs> you're funny. You're a clown. I actually looked up these. I saw these the other day, and I mm. love them. Thank mm. you very much. Of I course, appreciate it. Of course. We are on day five of my seven day final Korean girlfriend series. And as you could tell from my voice, I am drained mentally, spiritually, physically. I'm sexually frustrated. Because there was a flood last night. There was a literal flood in Korea while I'm still trying to make this series work. Not to mention, the date didn't really go well. I hate this so much. <laughs> First night that I went out in Korea, I actually met this girl named Denise. And she just so happens to be an ex-K-pop idol. Welcome to Denise of Secret Number. Yay, yes. Hi. So I figured she would make for a very interesting date. Um, you know, I actually don't even know if she's single or not, so let's call her and find out. But yeah, you down? <laughs> uh, I mean, sure. And now we're off to her studio. I gotta inject myself with some more Riz after yesterday. Ah, uh, don't simp fucking take charge, take lead. Oh, yeah, that's some good shit. I am alpha male now. <laughs> Never like been formally asked or ever like been on a date. Okay, I formally ask you, would you like to go on a date with me? I feel like I don't really have a choice here. You're already here. <laughs> I'm like, no, get out of my studio. <laughs> no, yeah, for sure. Let's go. I'm down. Yeah, yeah. I think what's fun about this is that I don't know who you are. That is true. Um, I know you are well known in the Korean music space. Um, going a little over 12 years now. I committed when i was like, like eight. Sc school plays you were just no on, like on auditions theater. i lived in la for a little bit did all that oh. stuff and then not you putting me down to school plays i did do that <laughs> stuff too though no no boyfriends no i would say i had one that was actually like a boyfriend that i actually really liked i never gotten past a month in a relationship Whoa. so i like to call myself a one month free trial because uh, were... they do the month and then they dip they, so they, yeah i always it, get broken it's... up with whatever it is so do you have the plan the plan. itinerary. So depending on what you want to eat, we're probably going to go grub first. Well, I mean, it's it's. You're down bad. <laughs> I'm just oh no no no! F pay pay for it then. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Do you really want to go to that um that mango thing? Yeah. The mango cafe. You, you don't watch anime at all. I watch casually. Wow. But I always did want to get into it. My problem is if I get into something, I get really into it. Uh huh. So I try to not what's, get into it. What's what's the last thing you got into? <laughs> Recently, I got back in <laughs> around high school, high school. <laughs> Red nah. flags, red flags, <laughs> red flags all around. I don't, you want to know an even better, bigger red flag? What's up? The dubbed version. To cool. me, that's a, actually a green flag. If it's only out sub, then I, I watch the sub version. So but you do watch dub. Everyone else I know, if I say I watch dub, they're like, you're a disgrace. <laughs> yeah, and, and there's some good animes that have really nice dubbed ver <laughs> versions of it. Oh, damn, this is bomb. Uh, you got it. Sweet and sour pork. It's really pork. good, though. Oh, this is pork. Yeah. So what do you usually do on dates then? Well, I ask, you know, date like questions, like uh, what's your type? I'm not gonna lie, I like skinny scrawny boys. <laughs> okay. Like type cleaner with eyes kind of beat. And then personality wise, I need them to be able, to, I'm not very good at taking care of myself because I'm very like work driven, like I'll drive myself crazy. Uh -huh. So I, someone who likes to take care of me. All right, so we talked about me, let's talk about you. What's your type? What's my type? I think someone I could learn from. That is a very attractive quality. Oh, uh, I get that too. Oh. What are turn offs? Something that turned me off about, about like my last relationship was uh, having to update them all the time. <laughs> it's kind of mundane, to be honest, in my opinion. It really and is. And that way, then when you see them, what are you going to talk about? They already know everything. I think texting is cool to like coordinate. Oh shoot, like for sure, yeah. But that's about it. Like, like, I think if we're texting, that we should be texting in order to have a plan to actually see each other mm -hmm. and meet up. Too cool. She's giving me mad bro energy. <laughs> I don't know why. I love monster. 
I went on like a whole discovery thing about matcha in Seoul. Like that every every matcha place is like known for matcha. Really? Oh, you that much of a I love matcha. Crack addict. Yeah, a little bit. Hold on, F flex for the camera real quick. We got, we got rings. We got, Reset. we got the, we got the, we got the belt. We got the belt. We got the. Sheesh. Well, what is this? So you go in here and you just read. You've been to a PC room before? A PC I, room? I, I have honestly, I would, I would come here just to take naps. Oh my god, people do that. Like. We come here to take naps. A lot of couples come here to like hang out and cuddle and drink together, or just like, hang out and spend time together because oh, everyone really? lives with their parents. And, yeah. uh, stand up. Oh, you're joking. You're funny. You're a clown. I actually looked up these. The I saw these the other day and I mm. love them. Thank mm. you very much. Of I course. appreciate it. Of course. Is that what he was getting? You're a clown. Wow. Oh my gosh. Y'all are slick though, I'm not gonna lie. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We move as a team, as a unit. That is amazing. Thank you very much. You are the first guy that's ever brought any flowers. What? Yeah. Get the fuck out. I, I know it's cliche, but it's no, just like... No, it's great. I, I'm cliche. I love cliche. Yeah. This is sick. Thank you so much. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I was gonna you do a chest bump. I'm for somebody to test me right now. Oh, I'm trying to fight. Thanks. Oh yeah. Thank you. Honestly, t bro, today I was like, I need one of these, bro. I need to take a nap, bro. This is date number five. And, and, and I'm exhausted. Like, I'm trying to make conversation. She, she was, she was great. That fellas is what you call a high quality woman. Um, Denise, if you watch this, I think she's one of the mo more, probably one of the, the most wholesome girls. She's on the grind. She's, she's very, she's a very ambitious woman. Um, and, and, and she's young too. I think a lot of times she probably d dismisses guys, but really I think guys around her age group also probably don't even know what to do with, with a woman like that. Honestly, I rushed it today. I think I called her around like 1 p.m., 2 p.m. and then we had the date set up for like 3 p.m. and then we just head out. We hung out for like three, four hours. Honestly, I feel, I feel like I could talk to her for like ages. I think that he's a really energetic, bright, sweet guy. And I think in a relationship, anyone would be very lucky to have him. If I could, I guess, rate the date, if that's what you can call that we had, I would say 10 out of 10. I thought it was super chill, super solid. Uh, I really appreciated the flowers that he gave me at the end. It was a very sweet touch. So I think that the date went well, I guess. Um, would I go on another one? Probably. I think more than that, I would just like to get to know him better. And it would be really fun to just go out and chill and kick back. But I'm not gonna lie, I the heart wants what it wants, bro. I think uh, I, I, I want to see again. Wonder if she felt the same way. Pretty sure she did. Okay, guys, I'm gonna hit this unless you text right now. I'm down bad. This is my most vulnerable form.